What's up, everybody? Spare with a gun here from Sleepless Nights with another episode on Space Engineers. Uh, back on the Black Pearl project. When we left off, uh, we had kind of figured out and fixed the um, sails for the most part, I think. I think they're as good as they're going to get. Probably could be better, but you know. Um, so I think this episode, I think what we're going to do is work on the power and thruster situation down here. Mostly because we haven't done that yet. At all. And that's kind of important. We do have... Excuse me. We do have one small reactor, which is powering... I wonder... I never actually took the time to read these things. But you're supposed to be able to go in and see... Alright, max power output. They don't show you how much these are taking, but it shows you what they're powering. So you could turn off individual... Thingies. Oh, and then there's the inventory screen. Oh, I just got an idea. That means that you could do stuff like in pirates, as this is a pirate ship after all. Um, where can you do it from here? Maybe. Oh, you can. So you could come into here and turn these off while everything else is still powered. And then that could be like when he says douse the lamps, you know, and run run dark kind of thing. Oh, that could be cool. You could do a lot of cool stuff with that. Whom. I love those. Those look so like futuristic lanterns. It's awesome. Um all right. So I kind of want to put these down here, but I don't know. Maybe that will work out better. Does the gravity affect all the way back here? Yes, it does. Okay, good. So what we need... What do we need here? What we need is power, thrusters, and gyroscopes. Now, we've got a lot of room, actually, down here. If we wanted to kind of block this off, but I don't think we're going to. I think what we're going to do... Let's turn mirror mode on here so I don't forget. What I actually think I want to do is something like this. Okay, don't built. That's perfectly fine. Um, what I'm thinking is having this first deck kind of be... Um, like, obviously we'll need the, um, the captain's quarters to be back in here somewhere. I think. I think it's back here, right? Maybe not. I don't know. Um, but I'd like this this part, right where these cross beams are, to kind of be... Um, I'd actually like to do real storage units. Like, um... Like they have in the movies. Because there are cargo... things... <coughs> cargo containers in this game. Um, frankly, all of my other builds never really had a whole lot of room for... I, I suppose I could have done... I could have put stuff in the Falcon, I just wasn't that experienced with space engineers yet. I didn't know all of the things that make it tick, per se. Um, so I didn't know you could do that at first. Uh, but I'd really like to is actually make it kind of resemble the way it is in the movie. So that you could actually do some of those you know, storage units and... Oh! Oh, jeez. Oh, well. Uh, okay. Jetpack back on. Um, but yeah, I thought that would be kind of neat, is actually where the ship would normally have cargo. Um, to be able to put actual various sized cargo containers. Come on, man. Stop. Stop derping around. What are you doing? Thank you. Um, and I think this is all going to be cargo area, and then uh, whatever we have left over, we're going to leave a bit of room here. Oh, I started on the wrong side. Where's that go? Okay. Um, and then we'll kind of take up whatever room is underneath here. I know that technically speaking, it should probably have multiple decks. Um, and in reality, 
as being that this is a large ship design, you could let's let's play around with that a little bit. Wow, I don't know why when you take the jetpack off, everything's like shaky when you move around. I don't know if that's supposed to be there or not. But let's try this. I want to see what happens if we do this. Uh, I don't know. Maybe the first one can be... So, would this be... a comparable... floor? Or would this be too thin? I don't know. Oops. Didn't mean to do that. I don't know. Let me know what you guys think, because I'm probably not going to work exactly on this part in this episode, so um, give me your thoughts on whether or not one floor is enough. Although, let me see something here. Whoops, a daisy. This is nice. This, I think, is roomy enough. A too, too tall. So, let's see. I'm, I'm wondering if we have the room Could do that. Okay, so I think this is what we're gonna do. I think we're gonna lower this floor by one, maybe. Because that actually, this this is a decent amount of room here. I mean, there's this is pretty big for just thrusters and power and gyros and stuff like that. There's a, a good amount of room here, but if we drop this floor down then it would make this one... It would make both of them too tall, in essence. And I mean the numerical too, not like they're too tall. Um, that should be obvious, but you never know. Sometimes people don't understand what you mean. Okay, so I don't remember exactly how old this was. No holes, that's a good sign. Because, yeah, I think the... Although, technically, the one... One tall floor would be okay. I think it's a little... It just feels too small. Like... You know what I mean. Like this. Technically... You know, you've got room that you can kind of jump, but it just feels cramped. So I don't think we want to do this. Um... So let's see if we can clear some, come on, clear some of this out. Um, and we'll just start it down there. That'll be kind of my marker. And actually, I wonder if we can, oops, I hope that's nothing important. We'll have to examine that later. <laughs> Double check and make sure I didn't break anything. Um, if we take this out far enough, I don't know if I can get it in first person or not, or third person, I mean. Okay, we're going to turn our jetpack on just because. Can I get rid of this? Yes, you can. It'll probably be back there in a second. I don't understand that bug either. It's like when I have the jetpack on and you're up against the roof, it doesn't want to let you look around for some reason. It's rather odd. Okay, now from here... Oops, my mouse was sliding off my uh, mouse pad there. Okay, and then we can get rid of these. That shift control thing is amazing. We'll just lower them. Like so. And that'll give us too high on both. And that I think will end up working a lot better. I don't know how far out I can go with that. It's probably better to take it from this. What's going on? Oh crap, I did that whole control 
thing I do sometimes where you try and fly. Um, I'm stuck with a copy of the ship now and I can't see where I'm going. Okay. That's just dandy. How do I not paste this? Can I just not do that? Oh gosh. Um Um <laughs> Um Crap, where's it going? Yeah. It's gone. Just let it go. <laughs> I wonder if it'll ever stop. I don't have any thrusters in there. It's lost to the world. Someday there will be legends told of the mythical Black Pearl that sailed off into the sky and was never seen again. Yeah. Eh, you know, what are you gonna do? At least it's got beacons on it. I can always go back and find it. <laughs> oh, jeez. Can you still... No, it's gone. Those numbers are just gonna... Keep on trucking. I wonder what'll happen with that, actually. Like, um... What happened here? Why can't I... Why can't I select anything? What the heck? What is going on? I can't... What did I do? I broke it. I broke something. Can't click on it. What happened? What did I do? Okay, I can still get in it. It's still considered a ship. So why can't I build anything? Um. Yeah. Mm hmm. I have no idea what is going on right now. I can't build or break anything on this ship. So, I think I'm going to pause it and come back and try and fix this, and then we'll be back. So, I'll be back in a second. All right, and I'm back. So, I went ahead and laid the ground floor. I threw in a few lights, but as big as this ship is, it's really not doing much yet, so. I decided to hold off on that. Um, I was going to leave that ship, that extra one in here, and just kind of, when I post the link to Steam, I was going to kind of make it a joke, like, hey, hey, try and find the mystery ship, but it was a heck of a lot easier just to reload the world save before I had done any of that, as opposed to um, trying to figure out what I did wrong. So this is just... I kind of reloaded it and and fix what I did, if you will. Um, so yeah, I think this is gonna work. I hope this is gonna work. It better work. I'm gonna be mad if it doesn't. Okay, where does this stop? Right there. Something like that. Oh. Can't put it there because of the light. There we go. Um, I really can't wait to see what the what else they end up doing with this game. Like there's supposed to be welding and stuff that'll eventually show up, and I'm really excited about that. And multiplayer. Good lord, that'll be awesome. Um, Adrian Wanna Fly, who's often on my channel along with bass player KG um, keeps telling me he's like um, you know man when are they gonna get multiplayer implemented already and it's like I know it would be so awesome to do a co-op build or or even just being able to like you know build a couple fighters or especially with the copy and paste thing now we could you know copy two Millennium Falcons and and attack each other or something I don't know see who could who could uh, ram the other one and do more damage? Alright. 
so now we come to the fun part. Before we get into decorative and design, let's grab, what is this, large, large and small reactors, gyroscopes, and, oops, wrong slot, large and small thrusters, as I'm not sure what I'll need here and there. So how big are these guys? Oh, these suckers are huge. Um, the other problem is I don't know what I can cut out, or what's part of it. I'm afraid to break anything, because we finally got the exterior shape kind of right where we need it. So, I'm thinking, oh no, I'm thinking gyroscopes here. That's what I'm thinking, since they're one blocks. Um, can I, can, can you go like this? Thank you. I'd like them all facing the same direction, if that's not too much to ask. And... <sighs> Dang it, I did it again! Crap! It's the control C, man! I've got to change that! Oh, they... How do I... Oh, okay, you can hit escape. Alright. So I'm not hitting C. I am not... Going to do it. Come on, stupid camera. Okay. Now I can hit C. Yeah, be ye warned. If you hit C while you're trying to do a control drag like this, you end up kind of all over the place. Um one of the last exterior things thing things 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 <laughs> it's late. Um that I need to do at some point is, um... Ooh, we could do reactors here. I'm trying to figure out what the best place to put everything is. I know I want thrusters. We're gonna try and keep everything in the house, I think. Oh, these thrusters annoy me so much because they have to, the center block, like, has to be on a block, and it's really frustrating. You know what? Fine. Let's just fill all this in, then. We'll remove this, because structurally we don't actually need any cross beams. Just give us a level floor to work with. We're gonna level the playing field, so to speak. <laughs> That's right, I can be punny. Come on, okay. So, I know I want some thrusters like this. I'd like at least two in every direction. If we can make that happen. Let's put two up this way. We might need more than that, I don't know. I'm just kind of ballparking. I mean, these are large thrusters, so I'm hoping we can kind of get away with it. Oh, come on, dude. Stop being so stupid. Okay, and then one and two. So we have forward, back, left, and right. So we need up and down now. Um, actually, let's put these guys over here. So we're kind of balancing our stuff. Um, okay. We could do... These guys we can stack, these guys we can't. So that's four. Two on each side. And now if we flip these. Oh! That's the other thing we can do, is go this way. So one. 
Um, hmm. If we leave room... Maybe like this? Two... How close is that? So it's... Wasn't exactly what I had in mind. Oh, wait a minute. How big are these? Let's put a couple here. That's good. It's good. I like where that's going. All right, now just for giggles. <laughs> that was that was a giggle. Um, I kind of want to see... Why am I floating all over the place? Good lord. I kind of want to see how this runs already. Um, we should probably build the staircase before we did get too crazy with the specs. Um, just because this is a pretty massive ship in terms of, like, mass. Is it, like, six million kilograms? Okay, so it's moving, but very slowly, so we're gonna need more engines, which probably means more power. I've yet to figure out what that ratio is, the whole, um, just, come on, dude. Oh, I hate this new flying system that they implemented. No offense to the uh, devs, but it's way worse than it was before. The flight thing in the... The older version was a lot better. Um, Alright, so we're going to need more engines by that performance test there, because it was not going very fast at all. So there's two more, or four more. One thing I never was able to figure out, though, is, is there a spot where you can tell... I can't figure out how much power each of these takes, and it can be kind of a pain in the neck because I never know how many reactors I'll need. Um, so there's those. Oh, I'm hitting the wrong buttons over here. That's why they're not turning. Okay, so we're basically doubling up, I guess. Now I I don't know if I can double these or not, just because of where they're positioned. Actually, I can. So, wait, what? If we move these over one, we actually can stack them up. There's eight here now. Now, we do have some room on the side for stuff, but I don't know. We're, we're getting pretty cramped on space pretty fast. So, I don't know if this will actually end up being enough why does W keep making me fly upward? Um, I'm not sure if this will be enough or not, so let's check the... How do I get... S oh, it's... Okay, the gyros are pretty good. Um, maybe could use a few more, but I don't know, that kind of gives it the... the feel. feel like an actual ship kind of thing. I don't know. I suppose it's moving pretty good. 
If we have some extra room, there may be room for improvement, though, because it's still kind of slow. I mean, the old sailing ships really weren't supposed to be uber fast, but it could stand to be a little bit faster if we can find a place for it. Um, so I think I'm gonna I think I'm gonna end it here before we get into too many other side projects. Oh, I forgot you can sprint. Totally forgot about that. We. Um, so yeah, I think we're gonna end that end this episode here. Um, I hope you all enjoyed. If you did, leave a like, and I will see you in the next one. Peace.